G'day, Alistair Christie here from LearnDelphi.tv and in this video, a bit of a random topic, we are going to look at the grayscale factor on an image list. And if we just have a look at this image list, we'll see I've added a bunch of random uh, images and I've added those to buttons and menu items. So if we just run this, like so, and we're currently in Delphi 10.3. And if we um, also see, we, if we go to bind visually, we'll see that the checkbox I've hooked up to uh, all the enable properties of the various controls. And in this track bar, I am setting the grayscale factor. And it goes between 0 and 255. So if we run this on 10.3 and I disable, we'll see that these images are quite horrible. They're sort of high contrast embossed versions of the, the images. But if I set the grayscale factor, I go all the way to 255, we'll see that they're now nice grayscale images. And somewhere in the middle, they're a bit darker, and down here, they're very dark. And it doesn't seem to affect the T buttons at all. So that's 10.3. Uh, and so enabling the grayscale factor or setting it to 255 or something similar um, makes your menu items look a lot nicer when they are disabled. Now in Delphi 10.4, I'll just build that to make sure I'm running the correct version. Again, I go disabled. We'll see we've got uh, the now uh, grayed out. And by default, our images are, are grayscale. And we can change the, I think the default becomes 255. And if we set it back to zero, um, the, the light gray again. So um, that's just a random um, topic. So if you're running uh, a version of Delphi before 10.4, uh, and you have go set the grayscale factor on your image list, uh, your images will look a lot, lot nicer when disabled on menu items and possibly other, other places as well, I'm not sure. Um, but that's that's quite an uh, improvement and I'm not sure what version of Delphi that was introduced in. So anyway, but I'm Alice Christie. I hope you found this interesting. Uh, I'll catch you in another video.